Hi, this is Steve Diogo with Dental Products Report, and today we're talking about Max in the dental practice. Um, I know for me, I always was one of those people who considered PCs to be serious machines, Macs to be more for the creative types. Uh, so I was a late bloomer with Macs, you could say. For me, it all started with this. Um, once I got this a couple of years ago, really opened my eyes to the elegance, uh, the simplicity, and, and just the, the wonderful user experience involved in Apple products. Um, when I got the iPhone, I figured, why would anyone ever need an iPad? Then I got an iPad, now I can't live without it. And now my work day generally has my Mac, my iPad, and my iPhone all on my desk in front of me, all doing different things. Um, but in the dental practice landscape, uh, I know PCs are still the dominant machines. Um, Macs haven't made huge inroads. Um, so today we're going to discuss why that is and, and what's out there to, uh, to think about changing that. Um, we are going to be talking with Troy Jensen from Vive. Um, Vive is a Mac-based practice management system for dentists um, from Henry Schein. So, Troy. Yes, sir. Um, why is there still this block um, for dentists using Macs? Is it what I experienced in terms of just thinking that PCs are serious business machines and, and Macs are more creative? That's been the general consensus over time. Uh, typically, you've seen most businesses or most dental practices utilize PC software because for a long time, that's really all there was. There wasn't a lot of updates done in, in terms of software. There wasn't a lot of functionality that was provided in the Mac side of things until recently. And that meant that offices were limited in software, they were imitate, limited in other solutions, and they, they worried that if they were to run their practice on a Mac, they would have to give up some of that functionality that they've experienced all these years on PCs. Well, today Macs are definitely a lot more attractive uh, for all kinds of small businesses, not even just in the dental world. Um, but especially the dental world has had a huge shift to go Mac. And there's a lot of software solutions that are currently available uh, that continue to have development take place that make it possible for dental offices to get just as much function, just as much functionality out of Mac programming as they've currently had with PC programming. Great. So before we even talk about the software, I mean, just in terms of the Mac versus PC debate, really what, what would the benefit be of switching to Macs for a dental practice? It's a great question. A lot of a lot of uh, individuals like myself, I'm very attracted to the image and the style of a Mac device. Uh, you, you mentioned you know you've been using an iPhone. Uh, I use an iPhone myself. iPads, you know, all of the Mac devices. There's definitely a certain level of quality you get, not only with the image and the style, but with your longevity you typically will see a longer lifespan with a Mac device than you would a PC. And stability, you know, you're less prone to malware and, and viruses on a Mac than you are on a PC, so it eliminates a lot of that IT expense that uh, businesses would have to spend to keep those PCs going where you don't really have that with a Mac. Honestly, the, the, the not crashing point, I really always thought that was hype until I switched over. Um, I am astonished at the difference uh, in stability between PC and one of my one of my rooms at home and, and my Mac in the other room. Um, you know, for when I first switched over, there were some some oddities for me. I still haven't adjusted to the fact that the delete key goes backwards instead of forwards. Um, but it's it's all tiny stuff like that that's very easy to to get around. Um, and I think a lot of people are you know maybe they even have Macs at homes, but they have PCs in the office. Um, now I've finally reached a point where I have to try to remember how to use the, the, the little PC tricks instead of the Mac tricks. So um, let's talk about Vive. Um, I understand that it was actually developed by, by dentists, um, but uh, so tell me a little about that and just uh, the, the benefits of Vive. Vive is a software that was built by dentists, Mac enthusiast dentists. Uh, it was built by them for dentists. So it has a, a, a true Mac feel to it, but it's all dental. When you look at other programs that are out there, Vive really is one of the few, if not one of the only practice management softwares that can truly state that concept, that we are truly Mac. 
There's nothing PC about this software, and we're all dental, meaning that we have no other industries that correlate with our software. It's strictly in the dental software, and that's a huge plus for practices, uh, especially dental practices out there today. They're looking for a software that gives them that functionality. They're also looking for something that gives them an interface that uh, is patient-centered, which Vibe definitely gives you that interface. And they're looking for all the other great functionalities that you would experience on a Mac uh, that follows those simple Apple development guidelines. And there's a lot of those great concepts built into the Vive software, making it a huge benefit. Um, and then on top of everything else, it's a Henry Schein product. Henry Schein is a very large name in the dental industry. And for an office to go with a Henry Schein product, they're getting a product that stands for quality. They're getting a product that is, uh, stands for stability. And they're, they're getting a product that will give them future growth and development to help their office be as successful as they want. And there's nothing out there that can speak to that other than a Shine product. Well, Troy, through the magic of Google Hangouts, I can actually let you uh, share your screen with our viewers. Uh, and I understand that you can actually take us through a little walkthrough. Absolutely. I'd be happy to do that for you today.